uh, if I ever play off stream, that's usually what I do with like fresh accounts and how I level them. Is that if you get first one of that day, it's already like a decent amount each time, right? Like it definitely takes a while, but like yeah, it's not gonna but yeah, nah, that's fine. Like right now, I'm not really concerned, anyways, about doing like an unranked or whatever. I'm not really in the mood to like grind an account up right now. Maybe next split I'll do something like that. We'll see. We'll see. I have to figure it out. Is this the same guy? I don't think this is the same Aatrox, is it? Riot Costco lover. Oh, I have a rider on my jungle. Or as my jungler. Oh, I'm not paying attention, oops. Guys, bush cheesing though, kind of cringe. I don't really like forcing ganks though. Especially when I'm winning matchup, because then like it, it makes it so our bot can lose land. Like if they get ganked and they die, like the game's just fucked. When I know I can win my matchup anyways, even if I get weak sided. Like, I don't really like that my jungler is trying to like hard force like this. I do have the wave set up in a way where we can gank it soon. Like it's gonna push. But... I'm clear, and this here's Scar. Prepare to die. First blood. No, wait, wait, what are you hitting my wave for? What? Wait, why is he hitting it? Wait, my wave is frozen. Like, I'm completely fine here. He's just taking XP from me now. <laughs> like, I'm fine with it being like this. Because I can just remount. Like, I don't want to, I don't want to base yet. Like, I'd rather keep it. Now it's kind of fucked, actually. I'm going to have to push next wave. That's actually kind of annoying. I don't know why he was hitting it. He showed his base. Because now he's going to lose his camps. Like, the wave was completely fine. Look at my much XP. I mean, it's not the end of the world because Aatrox and TP back, so we also lost some. But, like, it's just the fact that uh, my wave is not frozen anymore. I'm going to have to shove it. I could have denied him a bit more. That's the thing that's like more annoying than like sharing XP to be honest. Because now I'm like forced in an awkward scenario. I'm gonna have to like, use my pot here. Uh, we hard shove next wave. We slow push this, hard shove next. But yeah, I'm still up XP because he just didn't TP back for some reason. But yeah, if I, if I just hard shove this, I should be fine. Well, that works if he comes back on the bounce like that. He does have TP though. Uh, all good. Kind of a late call here, but I'm still down. Whatever, that's fine. The only issue is my jungler is so far behind now in gold and XP because he's invested so much into these top ganks. Like obviously for my matchup it's really good but yeah he's kind of screwed himself now by forcing so much. I'm gonna have to do a lot of work now. Ah, 
I trolled. I might actually dismount here. You can't be lonely. Oh wait, what? I just missed cannon. Fuck, I thought the minions were gonna aggro up more. Bro, oh, hello? What is happening? He dead. If I ulted him, I would have killed. That's my bad. I should have ulted. It's still not bad though, because he just loses his whole wave now. A little bit of turret. He has no TP. Like, it's still fine, and I can get one plate before I boost. Wait, really? I guess he gets six. I don't know where his jungler is. It's kind of sketch. Yeah. I thought Diana would be here. Oh, she is. Okay. Alright, whatever. That's fine. I get her ult. My wave's kind of quick, though. It's not going to crash, is it? Yeah, she's going to pull it. Fuck. That's kind of bad for me. Was it bad to dive there? I didn't want to dive right away because um, he had boom plating. I can't go, like, I can't instantly dive on boom plating timer. He survives it, no matter what there because he has all in boom plating. Right? I have to get his boom plating first. But also, I wasn't sure if Dinah was hovering because she just took grubs. So it was like, that's why I was like kind of hesitant. It was kind of a gamble to even like take that fight afterwards, but as soon as he commits, like, I have to commit there. But yeah, like th there's no way I actually 100 to 0 him like instantly like at the start because he had bone plating up. If his bone plating was down, I definitely would have just sent it right away. But yeah, once he had bone plating, I had to play it slower. What? Yeah, that's fun. Look at his wave. I don't know why this guy's playing so aggro. He's like just trying to flip shit when he's down items and he doesn't have ult. I just wait for my ignite and I kill him. Yeah, like I don't know what this guy is thinking by the way. I guess he didn't expect my ignite to be up because of cosmic. But like Yeah. I can't go too deep here because Diana is here. Just, that's why I'm like hovering up upside here. Do I just win in base? Uh, I think I do. Yeah, I'm just gonna wait. It's kind of greedy though. I might actually lose a plate for this, but fuck it. It's hubris. I might as well. But yeah, I, I, maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I should just bond tier twos. I just don't really. I don't know. I don't like buying tier twos before I get my item. Fuck, I think I sent- I griefed it though. This might be a bad ult because he has ult and flash. I mean, that's fine. If I can trade ult with him, it's always good. His ult is way more impactful in the 1v1 than mine. And I only lost like two minions for it. So like, if I can do that, then I'll take it. I should have fixed my wave first. He has, um, flash, so that's why I don't want to dive. Because I just want to go to the grubs here. Will you stop bitching for one minute? Murder. 
it's, there's a house there, we can't. We actually just gave five grubs to them, which kind of sucks. But, that's because they had mid prior. Uh, it's Cosmic Insight, yeah. I've done it these last two games because I'm against the Natrox matchup, so I can be greedy and get away with a lot. That's the only reason why I did it, because of the matchup. Wait, he. I mean, it's worth. That's unironically worth. I missed my Q, which sucks, but whatever. An enemy has been slain. I got four points, though. Down. Actually, I can push this wave on. I wasn't sure if he had TP. That's why I was skeptical, but... Since he wasn't TPing, I can just piss like this. And then I can get the last blade afterwards. Are you ready for anything? Of course you are. Krugs? What do you mean Krugs? Oh, he's tumbled over here. I might have did I dash another one? I think my vehicle just like queued them over the wall here, and that's why they like dragged over earlier. I'm pretty sure I didn't touch them, right? But yeah, it looked weird because they were following me. I'm, I think it's because my Vigo queued them over the wall and they followed me instead of him. So I was closer to them, technically. Like, at least in their vision. Earlier. That's why it looked weird. Alright, got you with that uh, in a sec, Spartan. One sec. Next base, so I'll uh, add it. Alright, bro. For this pass. Ain't no way we're this emotional. <laughs> we'll take it like that. He's us. I guess he got me off the last plate. Really, it's worth. Right. I'm just gonna wait for Ignite and I can kill him for free. Yeah, I don't even need to actually. Oh, never mind. Oh, I got executed, lol. <laughs> okay, that works out even better then, lol. Uh, I think top lane it's usually better to get Hubris first because, um... Having Tiamat early in top lane makes it so you can never control the wave at all. Like, you're forced to, like, be under the turret no matter what, and if you're getting, like, camp, for example, um, or, like, you're getting hard weak sided, like, you can just get completely screwed over by having Tiamat, right? Like, I think Tiamat rush is fine mid because you're not even trying to lane mid a lot of the times, but top lane it feels kind of shit to, like, rush the Tiamat. I guess if you buy the other, like, the components first, like, it's not the worst thing. Because by the time you get profane, it's already, like, 10 minutes in. But, um... Yeah, I usually would say to get Hubris first, if you're gonna go it, and then get a profane second. There you go, I added your, uh, thing, by the way. Sneak up on us. 
That's really good. I think I'm gonna go Yomo's like on third here. Not the BM. I don't know if this guy's flash. I'm just gonna send it though. I don't know why he didn't try to like dodge my ult there. Like, see, if people don't dodge your ult, then it's like free. But usually, I would like ult in a different way there because, like, I was I, I was I was thinking maybe he would dodge. But I was like, fuck it, I'll just see if this guy just stands still. But yeah, if they like stand still like that, like it's pretty free to hit your cut ult, right? But that's some panicking more than thinking. Because if he's just thinking there, he at least like tries to go one of the two directions instead of like staying in the middle of the lane. Take their camps. Yeah. Well, that's my fault. Plus 700, yeah. That's why I was like, fuck, I'm, I'm roaming. Like, if you can get a free tier 2, it's always worth it to take the tier 2 gold, because it's. Just free gold no matter what, and it's not like a flip dive or anything, right? Like, that dive wouldn't have been the worst outcome, but like, it's just not needed there. I'm gonna have to go top in a second. I just wanna make sure we get this. I run straight top. Let's get to killing them interloping intruders. What? Really? That's crazy, by the way. Whatever, it still works. I should have flashed earlier. I thought he was gonna flash, though, that's why I kinda held my shit. Oh, I went into that. Is he gonna flash? I need a bus. No, it's when I don't drink mushrooms. Go top. Uh, Marauder. I don't know if I have it on this one. Unfortunately, I, I had it on the, uh, the Iron of Chow one, but I don't think I have any accounts or any skins on this account. Unfortunately. I might do some arena later, so when I do arena, I can do some skins. Maybe do like a couple of arena games in a bit. But yeah, I don't think I have any on this account, unfortunately. Your arena? I mean, if you guys want to play with me, yeah, sure. I can invite you guys after. Can I do it? I'll probably do like two more games with Solo Q first. Pick up that. Hey, welcome, Dinko. Hello, hello. But yeah, if people want to play, I'm down there, but. Is 
But yeah, we'll probably do solo queue for like another hour or so. Hour or so. Not done. The games have been good so far, so. Boy, yeah, that's the one unfortunate part. If you're like a fan of a streamer, that's on a different region for sure. Eight clubs, one lobby. <laughs> or that is possible technically, right? Because if you all first pick it. But we'd have to have a full lobby if you wanted to do that. I don't know if we could be able to get 16 people in a lobby. But if we could, then yeah, we definitely could. No club bands allowed, exactly. I fight better when I've had my fist. Yeah, just one in ten, and the Aatrox is one in nine. Yeah, I've kind of just gotten like all my kills from the two of them. Wait, why, man? Why did the rider just steal my Penta, man? Of course the rider steals the Penta. Of course the rider had to do it, man. Sad. Time to get the rider fired. 